The All Recipes member who submitted this recipe comments, these tasty tuna burgers are so delicious. My husband is a very fussy eater and he loves these burgers. Enjoy. Let's begin by getting the minced ingredients prepared. Start by mincing a third of a cup of onion. Next, mince a quarter cup of celery. And then core, seed, and mince enough red bell pepper to make a quarter of a cup. Now, place one six ounce can of drained tuna into a bowl. Add in one egg, along with half of a cup of Italian seasoned breadcrumbs, the minced onion, the minced celery, and the minced bell pepper. Then, stir in a quarter of a cup of mayonnaise. Breaking up the tuna as you stir. Then add two tablespoons of chili sauce. A half of a teaspoon of dried dill weed. A quarter of a teaspoon of salt. and an eighth of a teaspoon of ground black pepper. Finish this mixture off with a dash of hot pepper sauce and a dash of Worcestershire sauce. Mix the ingredients together well. Carefully shape the mixture into four patties. The mixture will be soft, so handle it carefully. You can refrigerate the patties for 30 minutes if you like. This will make the patties easier to handle when you're cooking them. When you're ready to cook the burgers, coat a non-stick skillet with cooking spray. Preheat the skillet to medium-high heat. If you bring the skillet fully up to heat before cooking the burgers, they'll form a thin crust as they cook and will be easier to flip. Fry the tuna burgers for three to four minutes per side until they are cooked through. Be careful as you turn the burgers, you'll find that they're quite fragile. Serve these tasty tuna burgers on burger buns with tomato slices, lettuce, remoulade or tartar sauce and your favorite burger sides. All Recipes member Heather comments, I have made tuna patties in the past and this recipe had the best flavor and consistency, similar to crab cakes. I added a bit more breadcrumbs, about three quarters of a cup total, and served it with some southwestern flavored sour cream dip. 